Hey everybody, Marcus Collius, and I'm so excited and so privileged to be here with Megan Amelia. I'm so proud of this girl. She used to be a Magnum athlete. She left me because she thought it would be cooler to have babies. Yeah, what was I thinking? But I'm so glad you <laughs> came to your senses and, and, and decided I was right the whole time. Um, but I'm so proud of her. Uh, her lifestyle just, it, it's, it's so amazing that she is in better shape now than she was even before two kids. And I thought, what a, what a perfect person, what a perfect athlete to talk about this message of, if I have babies, is my body gone forever? And uh, Megan, I'm so excited, first of all, to have you here, thank you. Thank you, sir. And um, can you tell me what changed? I mean, it's mindset. Yeah. It's always mindset and people don't recognize that. Everybody has the exact same excuses that you have. You have every single day still. I don't have time, I don't have the energy. I, my, I didn't sleep last night because of my kids. This, 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 this. The problem is with all these excuses, they all end the exact same way. You feel like crap, you're way more likely to be depressed, you have no sexual energy, you have no tolerance for your husband and kids. Uh, name it, it, go on and on. And worse than all of that, your body looks horrible so you keep looking in the mirror going, oh, I feel like crap. Tell me. Why does that not impact you? What did you do differently? How does your mindset differ from that of the average woman? Well, um, like you said, I have all of those things, like all those feelings. Um, I have two kids, they're both under four years old. And it's, it's chaos, <laughs> it's chaos. Um, but for me, I do it anyways. That's what I say for everything. Uh, I'm up all night with the kids. Like you said, I was last night. My daughter's six, so I was up all night. I come anyways, I make a plan and I go. So if I'm tired, uh, I'm feeling well, if I don't want to do it, it doesn't matter, I just go. So I think I'm more committed. I'm dedicated to myself and my health. If I get in a good workout, I can be a better parent. I don't want to murder my husband if I work out. Um, I have more energy with my kids. So for me, it's, it's essential to work out. It's essential to take time for myself to train my body because that's what I love to do. So I'm doing what I did before I had kids, but now I have more reason, more purpose. So I, I have to do it. Love it. Regardless of how I feel. Now, do you have way more time than everyone else? Are you you got you got the nanny that yeah. can take the kids for no. six hours so I can go get my workout and go to the <laughs> spa today? No. No. So what I do is I drive half an hour every single morning to uh, a play school where my kids can go because there's a gym there. So I do it every awesome. single morning. I drive in traffic so my kids can go to uh, uh, they get watched for two hours at this play school. There's a gym there. So that's what I do. I don't want to get up at six o'clock in the morning and do that with my kids and get them out the door, but I do it. Because awesome. that means I get in that workout for sure. Awesome. But what about so, when they were babies? When they were babies? Oh, I you, still do it. I bring them to the gym with me. So I have, I uh, I'm a personal trainer. Yes. Uh, I work very, very part time, but I have a studio at my house. That's where I train my clients. My kids come with me and they love it. Love I get that. them involved. Like. They're a dumbbell, essentially. Yes, really. absolutely. So, you know, like, you'll see if you check my Instagram, I have so many videos of my kids with me in the yes. gym. I use them as part of the workout, so it's Love fun it. for them. But I just do it, and it's not always a good workout. So here, I'm so happy to be here today. Zero interruption, just Marcus yelling in the background. <laughs> but no kids, so I got a real workout in. But often it's better than nothing. Sometimes I get in the gym, 15, 20 minutes, and the kids are over it. Okay, that's all I got in. It's awesome. But I love the message you're teaching your kids too. You're, you're growing them up in the gym yeah. and health and fitness is all around them. Yeah. Do you think those kids are gonna end up being obese? Like, think about that, people. What you do today is going to impact the next generation, your next generation. What do you want as your legacy? I respect this. Thank you. Awesome. Let's go freaking have some fun. Okay, let's do it.
love doing step ups because you can do them anywhere. You don't need to be in a gym. Like you can be out for a run and use a park bench, use whatever you can find. You can be playing outside with your kids while doing step ups, which I have done many a time. That's awesome. Yes. That's brilliant. So I love them. So let's do it. Megan, yes. that was a phenomenal workout, but awesome. please tell us what final words on mindset. How, how, mm -hmm. how should we set our minds so that I'm a brand new mommy mm -hmm. in a few more months, as you can see. <laughs> uh, tell me, how, teach me, what, what, do you, what do you have to get me going? Oh, I think it just comes down to wanting to be the best version of yourself and not having any excuses about it. So if you have five minutes, 10 minutes, or an hour if you're lucky, great. But you don't need a fancy gym. You don't even need equipment. There's so many videos out there. You can check out my Instagram, but there's countless videos online that you can do body weight workouts. You can include your kids. You can do it at the park, wherever. Take the time for yourself and you'll be a better person. You'll feel better and just forget the excuses. I have the exact same hours in a day that anybody else does, and I get it done every day, whether I'm exhausted or not. So I think everyone can do it, and you will feel better after. Awesome, I love that. And for those people who are like, how do I even get started? How do I get going? You know what? That's what Instagram is so great for. Yeah. Tune into someone that inspires you. Check out this girl's Instagram, because all of a sudden you're gonna go, she can do it, so can I. All you have to do is get yourself going for that first five minutes. I can do it! <laughs> Yes! <laughs> Blooper real. I mean, you guys can help, but... Alright. Zach! <laughs> Marcus is stoked. <laughs> I'm ready to have a baby. Yeah. <laughs>